Today, back in solo queue, I noticed that we are currently in slot 5, so you guys know what that means, right? And as you can see, our teammates have already picked mid, jungler, and marksman. I'm pretty sure that slot 4 is going to be going to the XP lane, so we really don't have a choice. We have to abide by the golden rule. And yep, I see the dusty particles on my screen. Hopefully it goes away once we are in game. I'm not sure where it's coming from, but right now we gotta focus on choosing our hero. We're gonna be tank, right? Hmm, how about this guy? We have 3 matches and 33% win rate. Alright, I'm convinced. Because as long as the win rate is not zero, it means that we have a chance of winning. Hmm, the dusty particles are kinda still on my screen. It's barely noticeable now. I should've restarted the game before I started recording, but that is fine. We are already here. We got our execute and we got our dire hit roaming equipment. So where does a Johnson go at the start of the game? Hmm, I guess we're going to have to stop this Franco because we all know what he's trying to do. He's trying to pick up customers because he's a hooker, right? Well, as far as I know, Johnson is a member of an anti-hooker law enforcement group. So we gotta do our best to keep these hookers in check and make sure that they don't spread any diseases. Hey, where are you going, little raccoon lady? Oh, we're taking on the enemy jungler this early in the game. Okay, I'm with you and you're behind me to support me, right? And I realized that we don't really have a solid damage dealer here. Why did we start that fight, Nana? Why did we start that fight? Hmm, I'm not sure what skill to level up. Do you guys level up skill 2 first or max it out before skill 1? I think I'm gonna go max skill 2 first because it's the one that deals more damage. Meanwhile, we're gonna need more people here to help us out with this turtle soup because this D-Roth is about to murder our jungler, which is Harley. Get out of here, D-Roth, you're already injured. Oh, you can heal back your HP? Okay, that's great. But not for this Eudora who got smashed by Tarisla. This Balmando we have to run away from because he can kill me with his ult. It looks like he didn't. Okay, now it's my turn, buddy. Oh crap, I didn't look at my HP before doing that, so let's back away for a little bit. But actually, we forgot forgot something. We forgot to secure our kill. Oh man, it's too bad though that we didn't get that first turtle soup. This Diroth is just really sneaky. Yo, Teriz, let's uh, get out of here. Don't worry, that raccoon right there will uh, protect us. Now that we are level 4, I guess I should be spamming my ultimate, right? So this time we're getting to the top lane because I don't think we have helped our marksman just yet. But sadly, I don't see Mia in her lane now, so we're gonna have to divert our efforts in drilling this Eudora. And my job here is done, Nana. It's up to you now because I see Diroth is coming towards us. But you killing that Eudora inspires me to save your life. It's a good thing that you still have that passive. Now let's uh, get out of here before we get double killed by that annoying demon boy. Was Johnson's ultimate cooldown always been this short? I feel like I can just ult and then go back to base immediately after and then I can ult again. And also, shut up devil boy, do you cry? Do devils cry? Can I get some help here Harley while I'm struggling to make a devil may cry reference? And we are back to the bat cave. We have our ultimate again and this time we're gonna go to the top lane because I noticed that our marksman is dead. And that there's a low HP Mia who's ready for some ramming. And I'm beginning to notice that Nana is very reliable in this game. Also, she's getting banned and picked a lot now, right? I mean, what, what happened? And after a few seconds of clearing the minion wave in the mid lane, we have our ultimate again. And we're going to go around this turtle. Just to scare the enemies away from the turtle. Just like how Johnson mains do it, right? Except that last one. Or maybe there was a Natalia there that I intentionally hit and she immediately died. And what the heck is going on? How did we not get the turtle again? Harley, you better be doing a better job at securing our objectives while I secure our kills. And don't you guys worry about this, d he doesn't, he doesn't hurt me now, I think. And if you guys want, we can still go after this Eudora. 
Let's just wait for her to turn around so we can ram her from behind if we were a Johnson main. Oh, it looks like she was pissed. Why are you mad? I didn't even hit you. I was just trying to go to the other side of the jungle. And now you got a hooker friend with you. What you guys didn't know is I've been leading you to a trap all along. Where this reliable Nana, as always, will take care of the rest. Or maybe Harley. I mean, I don't care who it is, but um, yeah, just uh, get them, boys. Yo, why is our jungler dead? The turtle is up, guys. You know what? I'll just help our raccoon teammate here in the middle lane because she needs someone to get revenge on that archer lady. And I think this is the first time that we let someone ride us. I'm not really comfortable having Harley ride me because I myself have bad experiences riding Johnsons. They always put me in danger. But this time it might be the best idea ever because we got here right on time to save this Tarisla from all the kills that he's gonna be securing. Okay, I didn't get that. I was trying to save you from that bro. And did I mention that Johnson's ultimate has a freaking broken cooldown because I just used it and now it's available again. What the heck? So um, yeah, we're making our way downtown or maybe uptown here in the top lane where Mia is gonna have a bad time because I have my execute. At this point, am I even tanking for my teammates when all I do is recall back to the base and just drive and ult and hit random enemies? Now I understand why some Johnsons build full magic damage. Maybe I'll try that in the future but for now, we are going to give our full support and our tankiness because if I wasn't tanky right now, then we might be in big trouble right now especially when the entire enemy team is here. Do you guys think I won't ult on your faces? Okay, that Franco is cheating. He has immortality. I could have secured our kill before I died. But that is fine because right now we have the opportunity to let Beatrix ride us in public. Which is so much better than the time that Harley was riding us. And it's totally because Beatrix has area damage skills and nothing else. Shut up minions, I have to go around this lord because um, yeah, that's what Johnsons do all the time, right? And then bam, we come out of nowhere on these enemies face. I mean, um, I secured that kill. What was I saying? Oh yeah, I gotta save my teammates from the impending doom that is uh, Deeroth. Good job in securing the lord and also getting revenge for me. Thank you team. And the journey continues as we drive mindlessly around the map hoping to ram into a bunch of enemies which we're going to run away from because we really don't have any teammates around, don't we? But that is fine because after just a few seconds our ultimate is up again and we're gonna be able to help out this Terisla in making sure that this lord gets to their tower. And okay, I guess the enemies won't be making it easy for us because they're doing a good job in distracting us by dying. But it's too late now, the lord is already smashing their tower and if we just pay attention to the HP of the enemies, then we'll surely be able to secure our kill. But the fight is not over and I have my ultimate again. So shut up lightning lady, you're uh, messing up my circuits with all your electricity. And hey, it's actually a wiped out. We might be able to finish the game now. Alright, we have people, we have minions, we have everything we can and all I need to do is stand right here and... Victory! Ballman, you bi- Hey, we got the MVP. I wasn't really expecting that. But we did get a couple of kills and a lot of assists. And if you ask me about Johnson right now, I think he's really, really good, especially with the low cooldown of his ultimate. And especially if you can drive Johnson pretty well, or at least better than me. Which is everyone else, because I suck at driving Johnson. But that is it guys, we're going to forget what Balman did to us today, and we'll just be happy. Again, my name is Shinmen Tagazo. I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for your support and for watching my videos. Please don't forget to secure our like button and check out our recent uploads for the many and different heroes in the past. If you want to see if I played a certain hero, you can search Shinmen plus hero name in YouTube. 
And also for more videos like this in the future, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And as always, please stay safe, stay healthy, and always take care of yourself. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.